Rarity, I thought about it some more, and if you still need me, I'd love to be a judge. Oh, I just knew you'd come around. I, photo finish, have arrived. As has Hoity Toity. Oh, it's wonderful to see you. Kiss, oh, kiss, oh. kiss. Thank you both so much for doing this. We missed you at Miss Pomel's debut in Manhattan last week. Miss Pomel is showing? I thought she was still making costumes. You haven't heard? Every pony who is any pony is talking about it. Oh my, they're absolutely stunning. It sure is great to hear Miss Pomel is doing so well. Who is this who speaks? Oh, uh, this is Applejack, another one of the judges. So, Judge, what do you think? Oh, wow. Uh, that is just... wow. These are clothes? The photo is upside down! This is... She looks like a disco ball. <laughs> Did they have to roll her down the runway? <laughs> I can't believe any pony would actually wear this. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> oh, my! I faint! Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Uh, so funny. Oh, gosh. I didn't mean to make her faint. Oh, don't worry about it, darling. Uh, it happens all the time. Besides, that dress did look a bit like a disco ball. Although, Miss Pommel is making the point that no matter what we wear, it is a costume of some kind or another. I have no idea what you're talking about. And that's okay. Let's go meet the designers and help them get ready for the show. Designers, welcome. Today you will work on your designs, and we judges will offer our guidance and advice as you prepare for tomorrow's big show. Lily Lace, tell us about your inspiration. You guys, this morning on my way here, I heard a bird singing literally the most beautiful song I'd ever heard. And I wanted to capture not so much the bird's song exactly, but more like how the wind carried the bird's song. Powerful, yet at the same time, fragile and delicate. Uh, huh? Next up, meet Starstreak. <sighs> I'm not interested in what's already been done. Only what will exist in the future. Mmm. Tomorrow's fashion belongs to those who hear it coming. I am Inky Rose. You have a very focused vision. A strong sense of what you want. It's good. Applejack, you've been rather quiet. What do you think? Well, it's a lot of black. It's kind of depressing. How's this? Makes a world of difference. Maybe to fashion experts like you, but to ponies like me, it's still black. <gasps> and uh, I'm not sure how you wear singing birds, or the future. I don't think they liked what I had to say. Oh, well, that's why you're here. Fashion needs a healthy dose of practicality now and then. Are you putting holes in the clothes? On purpose? It's to create a distressed look. More like an old and tattered look. When a pony's old clothes get holes in them, they don't want to go to the store to buy new clothes with holes in them. Okay, yes. Not a very practical choice. Fashionable, but not practical. Simply stunning! Sure, it looks pretty, but that's a lot of fabric. With the way it drags behind, it'll be covered in dirt in no time. Thank goodness I'm here. Otherwise, we'd have had holes in clothes and dirty dresses. Mm. Well, of course, no look is complete without mane and makeup. So, uh, when are you gonna do her mane? Oh, it's already been done. You know 
what? Uh, I think we've given the designers enough guidance for today. Let's uh, let them finish their work. Uh, can't wait to see what y'all do for the big show tomorrow. I literally just 